To open the editor, go to CJS Tools at the top of Unity, then select Ultimate Map Editor. Before we start, we have to select what decompile we're using. Select Simplified if you have centered doors, and select Basic if your doors automatically set Baldi and Game Controller variables. Select Poor Key Powers if no other conditions apply. Select the Create tab, and input where you want to start your map. If you haven't deleted the default schoolhouse, I recommend minus 105 by minus 105. Now click Create. It will spawn a tile at the position you selected. Now we're in business. Click on the Edit button to enable editing, and click your tile. You'll see the Editor tools pop up around the tile. Click on a tool to spawn a tile on it, the editor will automatically connect them like in the BB Plus level editor. You'll notice black rectangles, these are AI paths, but we'll get back to that later. You can deselect connect walls to stop the editor from connecting tiles with others. Change the edit mode to edit to modify our map. To edit a wall, Double click it and hover over the UI, it will display relevant options. You can click Add Door to put a door in the wall, then Remove Door to remove it. To delete tiles, switch the edit mode to Delete and click on Tiles. Now let's create a room. Switch back to Create Mode and select Create Room. After creating your room, go back to Edit Mode and add a door. Now let's add some windows, double click on a wall, go down to the textures section of the UI and select window, make sure to do this on the other side. Click once on a tile to edit the tile itself, here you can manually toggle walls, recalculate connections or disconnect all walls. That is all you need to make yourself a good map, but before we finish we need to cover two more things. Baking the AI and hiding it, and textures. To bake the AI path, go to Window, then AI, then Navigation. If you see Navigation, Obsolete, click that. Click on the Bake tab, then find the Bake button and click it. You should now see blue over the AI path. If you've turned this off, you'll know. Now we must turn off the AI path, go to the Edit tab and select Toggle AI Paths, and now your map is ready. This section is for more advanced users looking to add extra flair to their maps, first select the Edit Textures tab. Let's add a poster to our wall textures, go to the bottom of the UI and select Wall Textures, click the plus, add a name and select the material. Do what you did for adding a window to select your new texture, oh, and the default textures are self-explanatory. I need not explain life.